I'm one of those people who really believes nobody should be left behind. If you want to learn, we have a responsibility to provide that opportunity. Traditionally, they have this impression that engineering is not for the people who cannot see. Wrong. We have to change that. If we as a community don't make those educational tools available to them, they will always feel alien about the engineering. I was sitting in the airplane one day and I was telling myself how am I supposed to teach the fly mechanism to the person who cannot see. I assembled a team and we start to build a wind tunnel which is customized so they can understand the viscose, drag, lift mechanism. It will be very loud. We also had some noise associated with the wind, and when the wind comes in, change the angle of attack, you have different lift and how we can land also. They could completely hold it, feel it, and relate with the concept. Okay, so that's the drag portion. Um, and then we also have a lift force. One of the students who was working in my lab, when she learned about my passion to develop educational tools, she said, I have a blind roommate. I came here because my friend, she got me into more into aerospace and mechanical engineering. You can feel the other symmetrical letters. Even that makes a big it's difference. easier to read this type of one. Because I'm legally blind, to understand something, I need to touch it or have a motion that directs me to it. Kavan looks at the social impacts of engineering work, and that's something that I wasn't exposed before. For my PhD, Kavan was my advisor, and I had a conversation with him, and I didn't know about the limitations in education for visually impaired students. So when he mentioned that, I was like, oh, that's great. We can work something that is related to my work and connects to your work as well. We picked this robot for educational purpose because we have this shell around the system. Because we have this, it's safe, and people can use it without getting harmed, and then understand all these physics that is behind the system. We can explain the stability of the helicopters, flight, hovering, pitch, and all this beautiful concept that we teach in the aerospace engineering department. We could bring these type of lessons to the people who never had the opportunity before. There's more than just a visual learner. There's auditory learners, and there's tactile learners. And so I think that it's important to be able to really focus on bringing as much inclusion into play when, when demonstrating and or in teaching concepts as complex as engineering and or other concepts within the STEM fields. Another very exciting project that we are involved is we are very lucky we have a very good and comprehensive College of Optical Science. So my team and I, we are working with Dr. Nasser Pregambarian to develop some smart glasses, which it has an onboard sensor for navigating the environments. This is sort of an example that the blind can be told what's going on. The um, technology that is currently in use in the self-driving cars, but on a person, we are sensing the objects around, and we can have an audio feedback to say what I'm seeing right now. Just imagine a student that has those glasses as well. They can navigate to the campus with no need to help. That build up the confidence that we need to see in the people who are not like us. The button on your right hand, if you push up. Okay. A lot of engineers like me understand that there is this impact that you could have socially and people life. It's nice. It's very warm hearting when I see next generation. When I see them, they have the same passion as, as I do to develop things that doesn't exist for the people who really need it. Education really matters. Things happen in the university. You cannot have a technology. You cannot have a health. You cannot have anything without having right education in the right place. 
I see the difficulties and I see there's a solution. Something I wish my time to That's basically the purpose of engineering. If you could make someone's life easier, I mean, what's better than that?